on. Bam! Let her roll. No visit to Los Angeles, California would be complete without a visit to the Wild Card Boxing Club. This is the home to some of the greatest fighters of all time, and I heard for $20 you can get a private boxing lesson. I'm feeling the eye of the tiger, baby. Bring it on. Here we are at Dodger Stadium. I'm with the Miss Chinatowns. I'm a very lucky guy. And tonight, I'm going to throw the opening pitch in a Major League Baseball game. Is that awesome or what? I have to start warming up so I actually can figure out if I can throw this basketball. Only I get to throw the ball. So I have to do them proud. These are very important people. Important people. Yeah. I would want to marry her. <laughs> going into the ring. What happens if I don't keep my hands up? Three, four, five. I think I can remember that. I'm here with Sammy the Toy Stewart. He's putting on his gloves. He's gonna take on the fan man. We're going one round. Oh, the Hurricane of Fury's coming your way, baby. Oh, God, that was a low blow, man. Oh, dude. Oh, God. I can be a contender. See this action? Oh! Go like that, and that's it, that's enough. Where I'm from, Sammy, mm -hmm. we hug. Good. That's not a real hug. I mean, you're sweating, man. Hey, everyone, this is the Fan Man, and you are watching Globe Trekker. Now, this is the travel show that's going to take you to some of the most exotic, fun, and cool destinations out there with just a backpack and with a budget that you can afford. Hey, everyone, I'm the Fan Man. And I'm Martin Cole. And you are watching In, In the, the Mood. Mood. We are the show that comes to you every Thursday night, just in case you have that blind date or any date in the weekend and you need a little bit something to break the ice, we are here to give you that information. Now, if you really want to show your date a great time, walk through the drive through line. Use your imagination, man, all right? I'm working on it. Two French fries and two large Cokes to go. You want to shake? It's like throwing gasoline on a barbecue. I've never actually been on a Major League Baseball field, and when you watch it on TV, it actually looks really, really small. But if you look at it right now, and if you're being here right now, this thing is huge. This is a childhood dream come true. You ever try a yellow jumpsuit on? See that applause? It's not for me. If I go down, I'm gonna go down big. You know, if you and I put on like Dodger outfits, they think we're real pitchers. I'm having butterflies. They say live for the moment. Well, this is it. Wow, this is really far, man. This is really far. It was like about three feet out of the uh, strike zone, but nonetheless, again, it was in the eyes. It's in the eyes. Where are the guys? <laughs> girls night out, girls night out. No boys. So you guys, it means you guys are lesbians, or? <laughs> Dude, they're Versace? Yeah. Girl, you are just like tricked I'm out. Gonna I'm gonna try these on. All right. All right, I gotta go. <laughs> My grandma's from China. Are oh, you kidding? No, I'm not kidding. What's her name? Chung. Chung? Yeah. Me too, <laughs> sister. We are meant to be together. You are watching Man Talk. Now this is the show that brings out into the open all the questions that us guys think about, but we're too chicken to talk about. And today we are talking penis size. I wanted to actually get my eyebrows done. Okay. Can you do that for me? Cool. Is it your first time? This is my first time. Okay, I'm not gonna look like a girl, am I? No. Is it gonna be painful? A little bit. Oh, it's Let's gonna be a little bit painful. Yeah. Oh, baby. That looks great. I know. You look like a girl. Oh, you look like a girl. <laughs> yes. That's what I'm talking about. That was a good one, wasn't it? 